College, where Penn State looks to wrap up their non-conference season against Central Michigan. Next week, it's the Big Ten in uh, Northwest. Michael Robinson, he's been solid in the first two games. Well, he really has, and this senior quarterback, you know, he's another guy. He's a multi-threat player. He's had 142-yard rushing in the first two games. Uh, he's been very, very solid. A versatile guy defensively, Alan Zamitis, one of the best in the country, no doubt. Well, I love great cornerbacks, and he is clearly one of the top corners in the country, a returning All-American for Penn State. He'll make lots of tackles and maybe an interception or two because Central Michigan will put it up this afternoon. Kickoff is coming up next from Happy Valley. You know, he, he's just something special. He's an amazing man. No question. There's the kick. Deep is Jasmine, and he comes out from his own end zone. Wiggles out of one tackle, and works his way up to the 23-yard line. speeds when it comes to calling the plays and how fast they'll run the offense. And yes, he can scramble. Positive yard defense up front. Tamba Holly, outstanding, great motor. Scott Paxson, a senior, very solid front four. Linebacking core, very good. Puzlesny leads that group. And in the secondary, Zemitis, we talked about him, an All-American, a terrific, terrific talent. Chris Sorrell back in the lineup now after missing all of last season with that neck injury, and he's played solid in the first two games. It's third down and five for the Chippewas. To the outside, first down, Central Michigan, a well coached. From the 36, first and 10, Smith to the outside, has his man, Jimmy Jansen, knocked out of bounds. Another positive play on first down, another play action underneath, and it goes nowhere. No Outstanding uh, senior, outstanding leader, outstanding young man, great student, already graduated, going for a second degree now in communications. Uh, really been a heck of a player. He's played wide receiver, running back. He's returned kicks here. Now he's a quarterback, period. And from the gun, Robinson with time. Big play offense, has his man on the outside. In Central Michigan, tips. Tony Hunt, the running back, and he just kind of sifts out here. And again, this is all set up by the scramble. It was man to man, and uh, of course, uh, uh, Jason Smith lost him, and away he goes down the sideline. It has been a very opportunistic and a quick striking offense so far in the first two games. Your screen, number two, dangerous receiver, and Hunt stays busy, gaping hole, has a chance to break this one all the way, but. Finally brought down at the... Yeah, just a simple draw. Watch the execution here up front, though. I mean, he just absolutely busted this wide open. The one missed tackle right there. Good block by the freshman wide receiver. Nice job. 39-yard game. It's first and 10 from the 10. Stretching is Derek Williams. State Indy Lions offense. We've seen Tony Hunt already. Derek Williams with that last run. Big play potential for the Penn State backs and receivers. Up front, offensive line le led by Levi Brown. Big time player left tackle. Third and goal, they cannot get a first down. And Robinson works his way into the end zone. Touchdown. Well, you know, having an athlete like him at the 77-yard drive, capped off by this. Hammer throw by Michael Robinson, throwing his body into the end zone. Tomba Hawley. Number 91, bottom of your screen, great motor. Smith to the outside, has his man. Does not panic. Set. The pitch inside it goes. The Damian look Lynch. out, look out. Gets a block, breaks it to the outside. And he's down around. Holding, number five on the offense. Is a 10 yard that play before. One of the rare times he's not out of the shotgun, gets a good push on the down line here. Central Michigan has not been great on third downs, just over 30%. And short of the first down, about two yards short. Two. Smith now under center. And he better look out, he goes down. The hard blitz from the outside, Calvin Lowry. Game charging game plan uh, by defensive coordinator Tom Bradley. Unblocked from the backside and down he goes. Uh, disastrous because that's about a 15 yard loss. And really it was a zone blitz that they just had, they had nobody to pick him up. I mean, nobody made a mistake. Team to have four seniors starting in the secondary. 
Robinson wide open to the outside. Hansen Hall told us he wanted to get him at least a dozen touches this afternoon. Robinson to the outside. Tony Hunt, good hands, picks up that low pass. position after that big time stop on fourth down. And there's a first down. Tony expected to play today. And there's Hunt. Robinson under center. Straight back with time. And overshoots. Beautiful setting here in Happy Valley. Tevin Kelly on for the 35 yard field goal. And it's no good. He pushes it. Smith gives off to Sneed, who's thrown for a five, six yard loss. Eagles lost their opener, but he's playing well. Look at 41. And th that's the key right there penetration. Penetration is really uh, the one thing that can it's really rush just... three. And there's that uh, shuttle pass underneath. And Penn State <laughs> has that figured out. First and 10 from the 38. Robinson with time going deep. Has his man open. In and out of the hands of Dion Buck. Go. Second and 10. <laughs> and this Tony Hunt. Four. Again. Robinson with lots of time. Has a wide open receiver. And Isaac Smolko. Drop the touchdown has work this afternoon. Well, give Penn State credit. I mean, they, they, they're very, very disappointed. Nice spot. Crowd trying to make some noise, and here comes the blitz. To the outside. Did he get enough game of the season or the first two and a half games? Smith with time to the outside. Has his man again, Damian Linson. With plenty of time over the middle. Four. And the two. Uh oh, look out. Hawley gets the sack from behind. Block him. He is absolutely unblocked here. That's a, that's a mistake in the protection scheme. And uh, boy, that's one guy. Second down and 13. Smith saw the blitz coming from his backside, so oh, he took This is off. all great for Central Michigan. Keeps their defense off the field. Three wideouts on the left side. And he looked for Justin Harper. He had at the Division II powerhouse. Robinson now on first down. Gets hit just as he throws wide open. On the outside is Derek Williams. Be a superstar. Nice job of Robinson avoiding here. You see Mr. Bazine chasing. Nice throw. Hits him right, on uh, right in stride on the sideline. Uh, wow. This, this Derek Williams is going to be something else. Robinson made a nice throw, knowing he was going to stout kid Michael Robinson. Dropped about 15 pounds before the start of this season. The pitch back. Austin Scott, first down. Nittany. Look at this blocking by this uh, veteran offensive line. I mean, wow. It, you know, hat on hat, uh, everybody get knocked off the line. Uh, that, that's easy. Mishandling that handoff. Robinson from the shotgun. Quarterback draw. Earned his first start a year ago, midway through the season. Robinson the outside, dangerous pass, almost picked oh, off. High school game against a team from Texas. And again, Kevin Kelly lines up. 33 yards. Missed one earlier, makes this one. Two for three on the season. And hits one. Sneed, again over the left side. Took a lick from. It just listen to this collision, folks. You don't think this uh, was a hit? Ooh. Wow! Oh. Third and a couple. That's Linson in motion. And the option. And he could go nowhere. Coming up. This is very, very well. Defense guys getting off blocks. Watch Shaw here, right here. Uh, he, he just measures the quarterback up, goes and gets him. His defense, especially, they play a lot of plays. Those guys, they don't, they don't substitute that much. There's Justin King who he goes ball some as well. Yeah, Williams in the slot. They go to the outside. That's Butler. His consistency throwing the football. That one got batted down and almost picked off. May be picked off. Let's see. Yes, it yes, is. Yes, it is. That was tipped at the line. From the 42, Chippewas with terrific field position. The pump fake. And he ran out of time. Rushing this week to, uh, you know, of course, he's been sacked some too today. Playing nimble feet that time, running out of trouble. He's and he runs it. Third down. There's the shovel option. Yeah, the shovel underneath. 
close to a first down. Was one yard short, quick snap, and first down to the outside. Jacob Brown, his first catch. That's the first and 10 from the 31. Busting to the outside. Sneed back in there after he took that pop earlier. And that ball is loose. And Central Michigan jumps on it. Crowd starting to make some noise. Smith hassled, and he goes down. Here he comes from outside, Blitzen from outside, right over the top. They're very poor. Very, that, that was a lookout block by uh, Troy. Tro he wanted him somewhere inside the 20. He didn't care where. And busted the outside, What's Tony Hunt. Mm -hmm. And the option to the right side. Hunt trying to cut it. On the defense, 15-yard penalty. It's five. And an automatic first down. All right, that's the big one, 15. Ryan Kelly looking on and watching. Lots of time, Rob. Watch out. Has his man. Touchdown, Penn State. Deion Butler. Wow. What a throw by Robinson, and the safety in the middle of the field just disappeared. Look at that. Now watch this throw right on the money. But Deion Butler, he, he's explosive. Look at this run right by him, and the safety was totally out of position. Boy, I tell you, and, you know, and give Galen Hall some credit. Nice job designing plays to get these young men the ball, to give the playmakers a chance to make plays. Here's the Three wide play. on the right side. Sneed lined up right next to his quarterback. Smith, whoa, whoa, whoa. he gets hammered. He goes down. Jay Alford they, they, is right there. Again, folks, that's the penetration. They're facing. They're just superior up front here. Take a look at the penetration right there. I mean, he, no chance. He has no place to go with that football. Now you're back almost. That end zone is so loud down there. Busted play. Smith running for his life. Third down and a mile. Look out. Flag down. Smith runs out of bounds up around the 11, but we'll check the flag. Kicks it away. Oh, another good kick, but he's Lowry. got room. He's got some room here to return it. From the 47. Good coverage. Yeah, he's so starting to lose their composure a little bit. Yeah, they're not in sync. Robinson with lots of time. He's in sync. And he goes back to his tight end, Isaac Smolko, who dropped that touchdown pass earlier. Full-time quarterback, and that's the key to get better. Excellent throw right in the seam right there, just over the linebackers. Yeah. Just in front. Robinson from the gun, play action. Wow. Open touchdown, Deion Butler. Second touchdown strike of the game, Robinson to Butler. Another throw right on the money, a great route by Butler. He's got so much speed that when he breaks off that slant route, uh, the corner just didn't have much of a choice, and the ball was thrown right on time. And I, I take a look at it again. He makes the play fake, boom. Look at that, right on a gun, right on a line right there. Very, very tough to defend. Poor break by the safety, and of course the corner's the guy that's got to squeeze this. Uh, that simply did not happen. And Doug, you made mention of it earlier. Absolutely no pressure at all on Robinson. I mean, he has time, three steps. Yeah. I mean, he's five step there's play. Nobody action. has no, no, no. out there. And there's that shuttle pass again to Snead. They run that at least a half a dozen times. Let's see if uh, Penn State blitzes again. Nope, they're not going to blitz this time. Keep it on the oh, ground. Oh boy. Oh boy. Snead <laughs> <laughs> ran out of Harrell's tackle. McCulloch again, the punt. Another great kick. Lowry back at the 19. Fumble. Center Mitchell picks it up. And they have it on the 12-yard line. Just like that. Wow. Jesse Daly. First and 15. Smith, the pump fake. Looking in the end zone. Nobody there. And now he is running for his life. Almost intercepted. And a flag oh, down. That's be Chasing him. Yep. And hit him after he released the football. Purdue, Wisconsin at Michigan State uh, finale. That's that's a challenging schedule. Smith challenged again, throws it out of bounds. Almost picked off. You watch quarterback draw. There it is. Well, you called it, and Scott Paxson knew it was coming. <laughs> Underneath. Justin wow. Harper goes look, nowhere. Look at those blue jerseys move to that football. So this one from the 21. It'll be a 31-yard kick. Albreski. 
drills it. And Central Michigan is on the board now. No yeah, longer shut out. Look at the really player's can't. eyes. Especially when there's a lot of shifting around on the sidelines. And there's Look the out. Down. Look out. Derek Williams. Look out. Breaks into the open. Whoa. Brought down at the 37 yard line. Boy, he is. Now, here, here's why he was the number one recruit in America last year. Take a look at this. He runs, he runs right by the blocker right there. Well blocked. But look at this cutback, right? No, he never did cut it back. But I tell you, that's just a great job of advancing the football. And Robinson, again, with lots of time to the outside. Down to the 20 yard line is Deion Butler. But against a three deep zone, he looked off the safety. Boom. Very impressive. Nice throw right. I'll tell you, Galen Hall. So the Indy Lions line up from the 27, a 37 yard boot. And yep. Kelly looks good. Okay. That's the longest field goal of his career so far, the true freshman. And that ends the first half. Bad football team. Nittany Lions are fired up. The defense on top of their game. Big play offense. Deion Butler, Michael Robinson, and company up 26 3. The numbers uh, just. Uh, Dominating on the side of Penn State, uh, 207 passing yards, almost 100 on the ground. Wow. Uh, time of possession, uh, Central Michigan actually yeah. has it longer, but uh, they're behind on the scoreboard. Penn State's scoring too fast. Mm -hmm. uh, rushing yards, I mean, that pretty much says it all right there. Central played Michigan. golf with Bobby Bowden this summer, Doug, at uh -huh. 76, and I'm amazed at his energy. Yep. He plays in 50 golf tournaments in the summer to raise money at Florida State. And Joe is 78 lines. Galen Hall again commending Morelli the way he has practiced the last couple of weeks. The handoff to Tony Hunt breaks two tackles. Nine. Nine. Happy Valley. The sun is now shining in the third quarter. Robinson, quarterback keeper after a great fake. Second down and 10 and the draw play to Tony Hunt. Big hole over the left side and he is running hard today Ooh. with a perfect. Good numbers for him today. And Robinson. Got him. Wow. Look out. Open. Anthony Scarato, touchdown, Penn State. Wide open. And I mean wide open. There was nobody around him. Yep, ding, ding. There you have it. Beautiful touchdown pass. Lots of time, wide open receiver. 33-3. Good job. Whoa. Smith trying to throw it away. Wow, does. And a flag down. As they grounding. Grounding, okay. Echo box here. Illegal forward Let's pass. Let's see now. It, that, that's close. Grounding. I mean, wow, I don't know about on the that offense. one. I really don't. By rule, that ball. Central Michigan backed up deep. That's Sneed. It's it's usual, but I'll tell you what, that, that's nothing compared to Joe. Wow. There it is, Justin King. On the reverse, knocked out of bounds. Third down now from Mike Robinson. Looking to the outside, showing off that arm. Has a man, Ethan Kilmer. First down. Robinson is really cut. That kid uh, did some weight room work this offseason, and there's the second down and five. Robinson again with lots of time over the middle. First down, Penn State. Would be the leader and the quarterback both. There's a blitz, and down he goes. Out, brought down. That's sure. design. Third down, over the middle. Oh, that was a lick. Derek Williams got right up there. And he talked some of those other guys to come with him. With time over the middle to Sneed. Gain of five. Quite a comparison. Finds his man open on the outside. Justin Harper, first and ten for the Chippewa. Another blitz. Another good result. Defensively, yep. so defensively, they got lots of speed. That's a good throw. They have That's to be uh, creative in where they recruit and where they find players. And the big smooth, Smith. Throws it out of Victor. And here is our guy at Morelli. Anthony Morelli. Crowd even, you sensed uh, an excitement level. Being <laughs> coming out of the some of these kids to deal with. Seen it happen a whole bunch of times. And there's wow. that arm. Yep, there is that arm. Here comes a blitz. 
Pumps it to the outside. Oh, there's football. Uh oh. Chip wise. Jump it. on it at the 13. Ball. Those turnovers. Smith with time. And he's going to get thrown for a huge loss back to the 31. And a hold. Matt Rock. Great players in that group. Yep. Yeah, look, look at the look at the push and the penetration right. Hold oh, it. he's got yeah. Number 79 uh, that, on the <laughs> offense. That penalty has declined. Yeah, there were yeah. second there were a couple of holds possibly in there. And well, Scott Paxton, uh, number 41, absolutely got tacked. After loss of 18, with a holding penalty tacked on. Excellent, excellent play. Four for five in the season. This would be the longest of the season for Albrecht. And it's got a stretch. No. And it won't. It's short and wide. Secondary coach, what makes a, out of high school, what makes a good defensive back? What do you look for? Well, See him the, the outside. Yeah. The, the, obviously, the first thing. His motor's still going strong, so I'm huffing and puffing, playing hard. Morelli dumps it off again to Rodney Kinley. Started. And Sneed, workhorse in the backfield. His longest carry of the day. This time over the left side, first down, a little bit more. Sneed. He's in this Penn State defense. Smith. Had nobody open. open from the 38. And Smith goes down, tackled around the ankles. And that. Uh, this is an interesting young man. Watch me be coming from the left side of your screen. And down he goes right there. You know, his, he's from. Smith with time. Gives off to his running back, Sneed. Oh, look at them convert. Look at them. Lieutenant. They're, they're not that bad of a team. But Penn State has played very, very well today. That was a nice pass on the outside. After the game at midfield, and, and unfortunately, it was on national TV, and they caught the whole thing. And a couple bad words. Hanging we around set. with a 33-3, 10:45 to play, and the handoff in the backfield. A lot of the students have filtered out, getting so. ready for what students do on Saturday night. And that looks like a first down. Yes. <laughs> we'll find out pretty quick exactly how good they're. Good throw by really Smith. Third down and two. And Boykins continues to be very busy. Gets a first down. And well. And another handoff, third straight. Really ridiculous. That's right. Because he said, really, when you look at college football, it's about half and half. That's right. Half in the booth, half in the field. And in his case, ooh, ooh, nice hit. Ooh, that was hope will take some pressure off an outstanding defense this season as Big Ten play opens next week. Kozlozny on the outside. And then he looks tired. He looks gassed. Well, it's, it's, he's been uh, you know, playing this style of offense is tough because you're, you're on the sideline. I didn't want communication problems. That was tipped at the line wow. of scrimmage. You talk about up in the air now. You talk about a bird. They have an eagle's eye view. They are higher than those mountains over there. <laughs> hey, completed pass. Thing, you know, but it's really not quite fair to the quarterback either here. Really wow. again. Shows wow. off the gun. And this one's going to go all the way. Yeah, no question. Touchdown, Penn State. Ethan Kilmer on the receiving end. His first touchdown of the season, 55 yards. And that was a bullet by Morelli. That was an absolute bullet. The kick in five. Here's oh, we're going to look at the uh, touchdown. Watch this throw. Wow. The, just the ball got there so quick, the corner and safety just couldn't react, couldn't get there. This is a former safety that, that moved to a wide receiver as a senior. Big kid, 232 redshirt freshman. And Brunner completes it to the outside. His first play, the freshman. Brunner to the outside. Second and six. And Boykins wow. gets taken down quickly. And first and ten. And the pitch back. Yeah. Just like I expected. I think the program going. Won a national championship. And there's pass interference. Patrick Hall. And 
He'll hand off. Red shirt. Sophomore in the classroom. Freshman on the football field. A lot of shows. Oh, yeah. A lot of blooper shows or whatever those shows are called. The, the top ten list. Yeah. Went to a New Year's Day bowl game down in Florida. Ooh, ooh. Well, there's still some, some banging going on yeah. out there. We hear that all the way up here, and we're up high, and you can hear it clearly. Well, it's a great day for Penn State as the clock is starting to tick down. I think that'll probably be the last uh, last play of the game. Rough day for Central Michigan. Great day for Penn State, especially offensively. Uh, get some confidence going as they head into the Big Ten season. That's the end of the game. With so Brian Kelly, head coach of the Chippewas, points out to Michael Robinson, congratulates him on a solid, solid effort. And now he looks for Joe Paterno.